Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, depending on where you are in this world. This is Hedgen Lee with a morning update for Bitcoin. Okay, so price hit the upper channel. And it's still well within the channel. So right now, it has been doing a decline after doing what looks like a one, two, three, four, and five. Now I've posted before and I'll say it again. This level is very critical. And I'll get into uh, as to why in a little while. So if we now go into, so we have one, two, three, we are working on ABC of four. Price did not pierce the upper line, <clears throat> uh, and if it did, it would have been, if it did pierce and come, came right back inside, it would have been called a bear wick. So if it did go to 11,500, it would have been called a bear wick, and that may not have been pretty good. So now let's go to 30 minutes, zoom in into this correction that's currently ongoing. So if wave 3 was here, And if price stays within the channel, so here I wrote support needs to hold. And for day traders, if this support holds right here, it could be a good long entry for the fifth wave up. So let's go a little more higher resolution into this. So I think this could be a zigzag. ABC zigzag. That's currently in process. Now I rarely go to 15 minutes but I will just to see more details of this. So now, let's count the subwaves because subwave counting will consistently provide you with a better geo positioning as to where everything is from a wave to subwave and a higher degree of wave perspective. So here we have A, B, I think is already done, <clears throat> and then we have C, currently in progress. For A we have <clears throat> wave one, two, three, four, and five. So if this is a wave and I have five waves down, then that is when I get the first clue that this is a zigzag, five, three, five. And the A, and now the B, which is a three wave. Now there's a couple possibilities here. <clears throat> B could be done, so A, B, C. Or we could have a 
a situation where B is not done yet. We could get A, B, and C. I have a feeling that we may go to the blue ABC direction. There will be a recovery. And then from here we'll go five waves down. In the case of blue, to finish the ABC wave four correction. And obviously, price can decide to say that was the B. We may even get a little bit of an overshoot, or a little bit of a bulwark. But it is imperative. that this support does not get breached decisively. So the support needs to hold. Even if we get a brief momentary piercing, but price comes right back, we're good. So in this way, we can see the ABC zigzag five, three, five, executing and taking place a very nice correction before rising to wave five. Now I had shown this before. Well, <clears throat> once wave five is in, at around 12,354 or 12,500, in that range, what happens here is very critical juncture. What happens here will determine the true bearish or bullish case scenario. Here, I put this in last night's update. We had massive volume. This is a two hour chart, but on the daily volume, it was like monstrous. Exactly the kind of volume you want on a reversal. And once price comes to 12,354, you might be faced with a potential to take profits, to raise cash. The reason is because this whole thing could become an A, B, C, D, and E, where we do see that 38, 3900. So basically, I'm drawing the top line from this top to this peak <clears throat> and extending it down. And then I'm doing the same for the bottom. And 
And what I'm saying is, once we get up here, <clears throat> and we put it down close to it, we came at high as 11.350. But once we hit 12.345 or so, what we need to be on the alert for is A, B, C, D, and E. I'm not saying this is my primary count, but it would behoove any technical analyst to see this as a significant resistance. And there may be a bit of a bear wick exceeded, maybe even to 12,775. And if it does exceed it, it'll be paramount that it stays outside this line. Otherwise, <clears throat> this whole pattern becomes a flag, bear, uh, bull flag. But it would still mean A decline of at least approximately 3,800. In other words, what I'm saying is be on the lookout, be on the alert for a potential bull trap. And that's exactly what this would be. It may even do a wick, get everyone frothy and excited, and turn around. So what do you have to do? As price approaches this top line, you have to see whether it's going to get repelled. If it did a five wave, it's going to definitely going to get repelled for an ABC correction. And that ABC correction could be uh, accompanied by a higher volume. But I'll get more into the indications of what to look for at this top scenario of an ABCDE, maybe today in the uh, midday post. I don't want to make this video too long. I hope this has been helpful. If you have any questions or comments, please do post. Have a great day.